Welcome all. I am Vishwas Khare from SSR College Silvasa. In this tutorial, we will talk about equivalent metric. Two metrics D1 and D2 on a set X is called equivalent if the collection of all open sets in the matrix space X, D1 and the matrix space X, D2 is identical. That is, if G is a subset of X which is open with respect to D1 in X, then it is open with respect to D2 in X and vice versa. Remark We can show two matrix are not equivalent by finding a set which is open with respect to one matrix but not open with respect to another matrix. Example Show that the usual metric and discrete metric on R are not equivalent. Here we will find a set which is open with one of the metric and not open with other metric. Proof As 0 is open in RD but not open in RU where D is discrete and U is usual metric space on R because we know in discrete metric every set is open and in U usual metric the zero singleton set is a closed set. Hence, T and U are not equivalent. Theorem The matrix D1 and D2 on a non empty set X are equivalent if and only if for each D1 open sphere SR D1X there exists an R greater than 0, R star greater than 0, such so that SR star x with respect to d2 contain in s r x with respect to d1 and for each d2 open sphere s sigma x with respect to d2 there exists if n rho greater than 0 such that s rho x with respect to d1 is contained in s sigma x with respect to d2 metric proof let d1 and D2 are equivalent. Consider the open sphere SR D1X. Then it is an open set in X with respect to D1. But as D1 and D2 are equivalent, it is an open set with respect to D2 also. And X belongs to SR D1X. So X is an interior point. So there exists R star greater than 0 such that S R star X with respect to D2 is contained in S R X with respect to D1. Similarly, we can prove the other side. Conversely, suppose we have conditions 1 and 2 to show D1 and D2 are equivalent on X. To prove this, let G be an open set in X with respect to D1. We shall show that the that G is open with respect to D2. For that, let X belongs to G. Then there exists R greater than 0 such so that open sphere with center X and radius R with respect to T1 is contained in G. Then by assumption there exists R star greater than 0 such so that S R star X with respect to D2 contain in S R X with respect to D1 which is contained in G. Therefore, G is an open in X with respect to D2 also. Similarly, we can prove that if G is open in X with respect to D2, then it is open in X with respect to D1. Hence, D1 and D2 are equivalent. Example 1. Let xt be a metric space. For xy belongs to x, define t star xy is equal to t of x comma y divided by 1 plus t x comma y. Show that t and t star are equivalent. Solution. Here, let r greater than 0 be given and consider s r x 
with respect to D. That is open sphere with center X and radius R with respect to D metric. Then take T is equal to R upon R plus 1. Now let Y belongs to S T X that is open sphere with center X and radius T with respect to D star. Then this will implies D star XY is less than T. This implies by definition DXY divided by 1 plus DXY is less than T. This gives DXY is less than or equal to T plus T times DXY. Which implies DXY minus T D into DXY less than T. This implies DXY is less than or equal to t upon 1 minus t. This implies dxy is less than or equal to by putting the value of t over here r upon 1 plus r divided by 1 minus r upon 1 plus r which is equal to r. This implies distance between x and y is less than r which implies y belongs to s r x d that is open sphere with center x and radius r with respect to D metric. Hence, S, T, X, D star containing S, R, X, T. That is, open sphere with center X and radius T with respect to D star containing open sphere with center X and radius with respect to metric D. Conversely, let r greater than 0 be given and consider s r d star x. Let y belongs to s r d x. This implies d x y is less than r. This implies d star x y is equal to d x y divided by 1 plus d x y which is less than equal to d x y less than r. This implies d star x y is less than r. This implies y belongs to open sphere with center x and radius r with respect to d star. Hence, srx with respect to d containing srx with respect to d star. Hence, d and d star are equivalent.